just want to write something on our timeline. The second annual National Women and Girls HIV AIDS Awareness Day took place Tuesday, March 13th in the Quad, where students were able to get information about the virus, listen to guest speakers, and get free HIV testing. Of our event is to let people know that uh, the impact on HIV is coming across to women and the rates are increasing among women because of um, their partners or various um, activities where they are more exposed um, to HIV virus and that's generally through sexual activity, unprotected sexual um, activity, um, or possibly um, drug use. The event encourages students to get tested. After you received the test, it took about 20 minutes to get your results. While you waited, you had the chance to take pictures for the Greater Than AIDS national campaign or write on the HIV Timeline Project, which featured a 20-foot banner with significant events uh, since the discovery of the virus. The event informs people of the many misconceptions. There's a lot of misconceptions, especially stigma. That's one of the big impediments in getting people to get tested, just a fear of knowing, and sometimes just thinking that they're not susceptible to HIV. And that's important for women to know. Stop the spread of it. It's a huge epidemic that's really taking thousands of necessary, unnecessary lives. And if people get tested and they know their status, they can prevent from spreading it to somebody else. And that's a huge problem. Statistics show that those between the ages of 20 and 39 make the largest percentage of people with the disease. Reporting for the Daily Titan, I'm Gracie Rivas.